Hey there, Aquarius. Welcome or welcome back to Star Sign Oracle YouTube channel and the Lucky Stars community. Cat Star here with your November 2023 monthly reading. As a reminder, my readings are for entertainment and are general in nature. They may or may not resonate for everybody, so please do take what is for you and leave what isn't for those of you liking and sharing the videos. Thank you so, so much. It does help others to be able to see these messages. That might not otherwise. I also want to give a huge shout out to all of the new and returning viewers and subscribers and to the channel members. Thank you all so, so much for being here. I truly, truly appreciate each and every one of you. All right. So November already. What in the actual heck? Cannot actually believe that we are already heading into November. It's just bleh, too much, too much, too much. All right. <laughs> I do hope that you guys have had or are having um, the most fabulous week, most fabulous start, the most fabulous for some of you Halloween. All right. We do. Do make sure to stay till the end because we will be getting some dice messages as well. But let's jump in here. What does Aquarius need to know with regards to November? Just going to get a, oh, a couple of cards out here. They're just kind of jumping out. Of course they are. Ooh. All right. Interesting. What else? What else? Abundance. Booyah. Yes, Aquarius. That's the only one that I left straight up. Let's get a couple here. All right. Okay. Yeah. Solid. I like it. All right, Aquarius. So let's see. You've got, I will show you whom to trust. Okay. So in the month of November, you have this energy coming through. It's a, was it that a kid soon? I think that's how you pronounce it. Number two, I will show you trust. So there is somebody that's either going to be coming in that spirits putting on your path that you can definitely trust or somebody who was like, you know what, Aquarius, you've been hurt in the past. I can tell you've got some trust issues. I'm going to show you, I'm going to show up. I'm going to be there. I'm going to support you. I'm going to do all the things and show you how to trust, allow you to feel comfortable and safe interesting in November. That's going to be huge for you, Aquarius. Okay. You've got a loyal guardian, Rottweiler. Love it. A magical protector is here for you. Number 33. So look, Aquarius. Wow. You have somebody who is coming in. The spirit is putting on your path. It actually could be two different people. Um, a person that is a protector and a person who is showing up for you to learn or remember how to trust. This also could be combined, combined into one person. This could also come through as a form of a spirit animal, either in reality or through a dream um, that could be coming through in November to remind you that you're protected, that um, there is somebody always in your corner and that you can trust. OK, this is just huge, gorgeous energy. You also have Dragonfly Mermaid. You're attracting wonderful news, number 19. So you're going to be getting um, a lot of wonderful news a lot of um, empowering, a lot of um, news that's going to be coming through that's going to really shake things up in your life, in your reality here in November, of course, and moving forward for the better. Okay. For the better. So you've got gorgeous, gorgeous energy coming in Aquarius. This is going to be a month that's going to be huge, but also a month that can't be be because you are going to be seeing some huge changes. You're going to be seeing some huge, um, movement coming through within people coming into your life, spirit putting people on your path or a specific person, learning how to trust, knowing that you're protected and attracting wonderful news. This wonderful news could come in the form of a letter. It could come in the form of a document of sorts. Um, for some of you, it's coming through as a potential of a windfall of money. You have abundance over here and or a huge inheritance uh, for the highest good of all. Okay. Beautiful. November. You've got strength, you've got justice, and you've got boundaries coming through. So Aquarius, there is this energy that you have been leaning into strength, and now there is somebody that is going to be coming in and or a few people that are going to assist you in being strong, okay? It's this energy of being able to do it together, okay? There is this energy of boundaries coming through in November. So for some of you, uh, strength and boundaries may be coming through in a little bit of a way because there's so much that's going to be falling away 
for this to come in. But for some of you, it's going to take strength and creating boundaries for you to allow yourself to let somebody in. Okay. Um, for you to allow yourself to trust again, solid boundaries are going to assist you within that Aquarius, but also uh, this person that potentially is coming in or this spirit animal or however this may show up for you, Aquarius, is going to remind you what strength looks like and that you are strong in all facets and the boundaries are a good thing. Okay. You also have justice coming in here and this is gorgeous. This is that energy of the scales finally coming back into balance. Okay. Spirit is coming through with this energy of, okay, of course, for many of you, you've done it on your own or you felt like you were doing it on your own or alone for quite a long time. For many of you, you felt as if you were in this place of really um, kind of five of cups here, picking up the pieces all around you all of the time. And in November, the pieces are going to all fit together. It's as if everything is coming together. There's a balancing out. There's this beautiful energy around you, Aquarius, where it just the pieces come together and everything finally works. Okay. You also have abundance. We talked about that a little bit earlier. I am a limitless being and I can manifest whatever I desire in this physical reality. Yes, you can, Aquarius, but that's going to be very, very relevant, very, very obvious for you in the month of November. Abundance is going to follow you around almost like a lost puppy, right? It's going to follow you around. You have um, an abundance of um, trust coming through, an abundance of uh, potential uh, feelings of finally having met somebody who truly is your ride or die or who truly Fs with you or is down with you and only you or for you, right? It doesn't mean that it's going to be romantic. It could be, it could also be platonic, but there's somebody coming in or a few people coming in that are going to remind you uh, about trust, about boundaries, about um, strength, allowing things to come through and that you are protected. A magical protector is here for you, Aquarius, a loyal guardian. Spirit is putting through for you. Also, again, we talked about that potential um, windfall of money or inheritance, that abundance. You're going to be just flooded with abundance in November, Aquarius. And that leads to the Three of Cups, which is a cause for celebration all the way around, okay? You're, you're feeling as if you are within a community, that people finally are around you, or at least one person or a few are around you that understand you. You're feeling as if you are just um, in this place of, gosh, everything's finally together. Everything finally, the pieces finally fell together. The pieces finally came together. Everything is right with the world here in November. You're feeling a lot of encouragement. You are ready to celebrate and with good cause of Christ because you have beautiful, beautiful energy all around you in November. It's going to be, again, November is a huge, huge month for you. You are relearning um, who you are, that you can trust, that you can be um, in the space of strength, you can create boundaries, that, that there is this energy around you where um, even if things fall away, better things can fall into place and that you are protected, loved, that somebody and or many are always in your corner. You're never alone. Beautiful energy. All right, let's go ahead and get a few of the dies here. Of the cubes and see what needs to come out. So you've got the number seven. The number seven might be um, a day where imaginal, imaginal, magical things happen. It might be where uh, one or both of these people come in or a lesson or abundance comes through, Aquarius, okay? You've got the letter X, the letter G, and the letter Z. Now you see X and Z are, are a little bit out of the norm. So the stuff that is coming through is potentially going to be out of the norm or the people showing up are going to potentially be out of your norm, okay? It's rough, let's many there, there many. It's rough, let many there. It's rough, it's rough, let many there, okay? It's rough, let many there, let there be many. It's rough, let there be many. Many blessings is what I'm getting, Aquarius, okay? All right, that's what I have for November for you, Aquarius. I do intend this resonated with you and for you. If it did, please do hit the like button and share this video. It does help others to be able to see these messages that might not otherwise. Also, feel free to hit that subscribe button 
and the bell icon so you're notified every time I upload new readings. It is free for you to subscribe to the YouTube channel and it does support the Lucky Stars community in growing and thriving. I do hope, intend, and pray that you all have the most amazing, wonderful November and rest of the year. We're getting closer, getting into the holidays. Such a beautiful, glorious time and cold weather. Not my favorite, but hey, um, I guess I'm here for it, right? Uh, as always, I do wish you lots of hope, lots of joy, and lots and lots of love with all of your current and future endeavors. I'll see you in the next reading.